So guys, I just received these two plushes today. I did take them out of the box. I didn't want to like do the unboxing thing. But I do want to show you them because this is uh this is crazy. <laughs> these are two rare plushes. At the moment, Big the Cat, they're asking about like five hundred dollars for him. No joke. So to have him tagged. Yes, I actually have him tagged. And, uh... I also had him, like, in bag, but I took the bag off. His ear keep flapping in the other way. <laughs> I don't know why, but... He's quite awesome. This is my first time seeing Big Plush. Ducks come with his fishing pole and he has this little fishing thing on the end. I really like the way he's made. It's like very well made. Like the close up of him right here. Iron on patches. His nose is like plastic, you know, just like Amy Rose's. He's done very well though for Big the Flush. Now, this supersonic plush. Oh my god, this guy is like worth a thousand dollars right now. I didn't pay that much for him. But as you can tell, he, he's, oh my god, he's like ten times bigger than big. And you know big is big. <laughs> he is a 20 inch supersonic plush. And I've been looking for him. I have not even known that they made a 20 inch supersonic because like they made a 20 inch super shadow but not a uh, supersonic they did however make a modern supersonic I got these guys up there they're hanging on their uh, strings and that's like the AI uh, backpack but um yeah this is a uh, supersonic He's pretty big. I can even hold him because he's so heavy. He does come with his tag as well. And this tag is different from the other one. And it has the new GE logo on it. <laughs> it's like a G. Great Eastern. So like, it looks pretty cool. He did came with his bag as well. Brand stinking new. Haven't been opened at all. I opened it because I simply wanted to take him out of the bag. So I'm only a plushes away of completing the whole GE collection of plushes. My mission and my goal was to collect um, all the GE Sonic plushes. So I'm like, I think I'm missing like maybe four of them. Which are the main big guys? I, I'm missing Storm, Wave, Vector, Charmy. Pretty much the last Babylon Rose and Team Chaotic. And I think if I want to even include, it would be a uh, classic Knuckles with the black eyes. I do have him with his red eyes. No, not red eyes. What the heck am I talking about? He has purple eyes. Um, that's another plush thing. They pretty much just changed their eyes to classic Knuckles eyes, which was kind of stupid, but I don't have him. I do have him. It's the same plush, but I have him in his Martin version. I don't know. I'm debating whether I should get him or not, but I am missing those plushes, and um, that will complete the whole set of the GE plushes, which are, like, very difficult to get now. I mean, they have gotten back, but I don't know if they will re-release any other new like, uh, any of these old plushes, they haven't released Metal Sonic, which I was, you know, thankful to get. But I don't think they're gonna do, uh, um, Super Sonic or Big the Cat again. Who knows? But I'm glad I just picked them up because I, I have to get them out of the way, you know. So, yeah. This is them. 
does have the string on his head, as well as big. He does come with it too. We try to do like uh, the UFO from Japan. But as you can tell, he's like super detailed. Very awesome plush. Any supersonic plush is rare to get, especially the 20 inch one. He's like hard to get now, so. I don't even think he's obtainable right now. He's like that difficult. Especially big. For some reason, big is rare as well. But yeah, I'm, I'm happy that I've gotten these. Alright, guys. Let me know what you guys think about this in the comment section below. And if you feel like you want to subscribe, feel free to. Okay. Bye.